I would rather suck Dr. Dre's dick than suck Will Smith's dick. Dr. Dre's wife. Whoever he, if he gets remarried, you better. <laughs> you better. I'm just saying. That's not how it goes, Gary. It's exactly how it should go. If you're that powerful, if you're that powerful and you're going to get married, babe, I need my dick sucked. Now. You do it. You don't be disrespectful. You don't be, dude ain't got to be disrespectful. I, but I need this. Well, see, first of all, my man wouldn't have to ask. Okay. Ooh, oh, oh, shit. He would, I already know when you need your dick sucked, and that's Talk probably about like, it. you know. Talk about it. On any occasion that you can, you know, to keep peace in the house. How about that? How about that? Look, I'm <laughs> the divorce guy. <laughs> yeah. How about that? How, what'd you, touch, who's say that, that one more time. <laughs> Who, you know? Who's that for? Say that one more time. What'd you just say? I'm just saying just, you know, if you, if, if you should do it, you should do it where you don't have to be asked to do it. Like, you should oh, do it. Oh, shit. You Somebody's it, preaching today. <laughs> Somebody's speaking to my soul. <laughs> this goes for the next woman. But hopefully you will want to. I'm not talking to. about the ex. I'm talking about the next. I, so I'm going to talk to you about that, too. <laughs> Off the <head. laughs> well, see how you that's working out for you. But I just think that, you know, if you're happy in your relationship, hell you you know, you you wanna do that and you know what, what's gonna calm 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 him down. You know and what you get? Do that. Gifts. Ladies. Yeah, that's probably why I buy my own jewelry, because yeah. I don't get enough gifts. I <laughs> I suck to all the wrong days. But, but I'll put it this way. It's give and take. If there's anything woman doing her stuff and she's handling you and when you need it, when she needs it. I don't care if you're tired, whatever. You For anybody go down. out there that I may be involved with in the future, just know that I'm a morning fucker. I love to fuck in the morning. Like, I don't even want to open my eyes. Do you, okay, do you want, would it be a turn on guy that you just wake up and the guy's going down on you? Yeah. Man. Talk about. But I have to pee when I first wake up. Whoa. <laughs> 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 I'm just saying. Whoa. <laughs> I'm just saying. Some people don't mind that. I could give you names. <laughs> we got a lot to talk about off right. air. <laughs> <laughs> this whole podcast, everyone, all the cows be like, what Thanks everybody fuck? for watching. Now you get to the <laughs> Yes, I agree. You got man. If, if it gets to a point where you're asking, you're asking. You're like this. Can we just, this should be natural. Or You know, if I got a busy day and I really don't have time to get naked and fucking all that and my husband's been a little irritable, then I'm just going to do that real quick. Boop, 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 and I'm out. Hook him up. Mm -hmm. Dude, ladies, listen. If your guy's a little irritable and he's, you know, on edge... And you're like, oh, you're just being an and asshole. And if you lady. love him and if you like to suck his dick. Because well, if you don't better. like, you can be in love with somebody and not like to suck their dick. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I don't know if that's worse than the pee. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's worse than the pee. What, what do you me. mean? How does that work? Well, I mean, maybe, maybe this guy looks fantastic. He treats you well and all that kind of stuff. But maybe he just, his dick is not appeasing, appealing to you. It, what if it's circumcised and, like, perfectly sized for you and mm. proportional? Well, then, I mean, it probably it will clean, be, but sometimes, but sometimes they not. So that's like, damn, I really like this guy, but he's circumcised. No, not you got to let the guy go then. Don't do that to the guy. Don't do that to him, because that's going to lead to tension and arguing. Well, what you should do is tell them what you don't like about it and see if y'all can fix it together. That helps, too. Can you get circumcised when you're, like, 40? You can get circumcised whenever I heard. But I think it's worth I got, I got certain size of four hours. What? At four hours old? Yeah. Yeah. It was like Well, you don't know nothing. You remember anything about that? No. I literally, but I do know that in my baby brain, I was like, this hurts, but thank you. And I told my son that when he got circumcised. He was like a week old. And I, I just got to leave the room. I couldn't even watch my daughter get her ears pierced, so I, I couldn't there. watch that. No, you can't no, touch my I can't son's do dick, it. And, I'm, and you fuck it up. Well, that's where you come in, the father. That's I, I did. I'm I was there. I like this. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I heard that 
when somebody's dick curved to the right or to the left, that they weren't circumcised straight. They were circumcised uh, accidentally, maybe angular. Really? So there's less skin on this side, see, to go straight. Dang. So it pulls to the right or left. Don't that physically make sense? I'm straight up. There's <laughs> straight up, now I tell you. I got me, that you proportional really? circumcision. No. Some okay. people have a, you know, if the doctor's going to like that. Yeah. Then I couldn't. I couldn't maybe risk it. because you'll have less skin here than you will here to go s straight up, so it's gonna pull like no, that. I had to be there. Or they used to say it was from jerking, jerking, jerking off that, that way. But I don't. But I did that a lot. you would have to start really young to make your dick actually curve. I think it's a circumcision skin story for me. Hmm. Let's get back to how you're supposed to satisfy your man. <laughs> Suck him <laughs> off on the regular. What, okay, in a healthy marriage, healthy relationship, how many times a week should you be sleeping together? How many times? Like three, four. I mean, that's good. Five if you really, really dig in it. Because you got to factor in. Try to tell in. women this. You try to tell women this. What? You want, your dude, you want your dude to be faithful. You want him to be there for you. Let me tell you something. Once every other week is not cutting it. Once not, a month? For, not for the man I know, but but you know, like you said, it's give and take too, because you know, we don't want you to just like if you don't enjoy making love to me and stuff like that, then yeah, let's just let's just go our separate ways. How about that? <laughs> you know, because I don't I don't want to be with nobody. I don't need a motherfucking roommate or a bed mate, and we just sleep together, and that's all we do. That part. And I don't want to just okay, it's Tuesday night. No, I don't want to do that spontaneous shit. Like, you know, if I ask you to lotion my back when I get out the bathtub and you just happen to rub my taint while you're doing that, it's on. You know, if if I ask you to rub my feet and you just happen to rub the lotion all the way up to the top of my clitoris, that's great. See, you don't have to that's be like, let's go to happy. bed. Yeah, my husband's happy. Mm. Wow, I learned a lot today. <laughs> so, boys and girls, in conclusion. I'm like this, look at my face. <laughs> like this. This motherfucker said four or five times a week. I, I like mean, this. three, like minimum. Minimum! Four, three, four times. Eight. Editors, this is a cut down. Okay? When this airs, this is one of the cut downs. <laughs> How many times a week, Lunell? I just think that it's reasonable if you are in love and you have an active sex life, at minimum three times a week, you know, maybe five. Do you know what happens if you don't do that? I don't know because I, I don't have that problem. Saying. I don't have that problem. I want to say, dudes are assholes and we ain't shit and da 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 da, -da Say it like that. Oh, asshole, I ain't shit. No, I'm not doing it like I'm gay. Not you. I'm like, if you want to complain about men, do it with their dick Do it with dick and yes. Yes! And you will get you know so you much! You know you ain't shit, right? I know. I know. You no, do you're it, an I asshole. Like, you see I what know. you're going to be missing I if you know. keep acting up? You huh? right. You right. You know what? Yes, here. What do you, you want for do lunch better? tomorrow? You going to do better? I'll bring you lunch. Mm -hmm. What do you want for breakfast? I want, you want something to eat? filet mignon. Yeah, I'll do the laundry. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> see how easy that works? <laughs> that works easy. And I don't want to hear... I don't want to hear kids... I don't want to hear work. I want to be like this. That That's cool every now and then. But it shouldn't become the regular. Man, me and my husband let them kids knock on that door long the fuck as they want to. Hold on. No. I'm fucking talking to my heart right now. Fuck out here. Get away from the fucking door. Get away from the goddamn door. Uh, uh, get away from the fucking door. Yeah. <laughs> God damn! <laughs> I'll be out there in a minute! <laughs> <laughs>